Hi everybody. So today we're going to show you a way to sleep on your wavy hair so that in the morning when you wake up, it's still wavy. My friend Victoria actually has been helping me out make videos and she has fine wavy hair and if we style it just right, we can get really nice and curly. In the past, she's always had a hard time keeping it curly on the second day, the third day, etc. And so I mentioned to her how I kind of scrunch my hair up against my pillow when I sleep at night. And I don't usually use pins, um, maybe in a couple places where I know the curls get squashed a little funny or something, but it was actually her idea to pin it in small little clumps all over her head and then sleep on it. I do have a couple videos where I show you how to use bobby pins to give some really fun hairstyles as well as how to get more volume at your roots and, and a few other things. So go check those out. She's also incorporated the Mandarin Orange Enhancing Hairspray that I make and I just thought it was so smart of her and I'm just really glad that she's doing this for us. She's a very real person. She's got her nighttime routine going on so she's in her pajamas and I just hope you guys enjoy watching. Thanks so much. So I washed it in my hair, but I had to let it 100% air dry today. And um, so I do not have the volume that I like, but I found volume or no volume. If I pin it while I sleep, my hair is great. I'm gonna do a little bit of a orange infused hairspray. because I think that'll give it a little bit of hold. So I'm gonna do it in sections. I'm gonna spray this a little. And then I just kind of scrunch it in, like if my hand was a diffuser, and I just put it, plop it in. Um, and there we go. Then I'm gonna put this little bobby pin in here. And then I do one from behind just to make sure. So it looks funny, like this little curl is not in at all. So I will, um, Put an extra pin in there. So this does not hurt my head at all. Um, I was a little concerned that my head would feel like I had all these things poking on it. I don't, I don't know. So I did grow up wearing curlers to bed, like the pink sponge roll curlers, but I, I couldn't do that now. All right, so I'm gonna do here, get some of the root spray there um, because I ended up with like zero volume. So I'm just like crumpling it up in a bowl. Um, anyways, I had like zero volume on the top of my head today. My fault, I, I put the stuff in it, but I just did not have time to diffuse or pin it or anything. I was in such a hurry. So, and this is swirling around like that. And so I think I'm gonna, Kind of maybe twist it a little. Put a couple pins there. Um, we go to this top, get the top layer, so I'm getting the back. I don't know what you can see section right here. I'm just kind of pick it up. And it's just sort of picked it up. And I'm gonna get a little hairspray. So this is just kind of gives it a, a good fine mist everywhere. Reminds me of when I was younger, when I would braid my hair and put gel all over it and then um, put the sponge curlers at the bottom. So I'm gonna take off my glasses so my, they're on the way of my hair here. Um, I kind of feel like this is too big of a clump for me. So I'm going to let it naturally, well, as best I can naturally. There we go, that was the natural separation. And I'm gonna spray it, get some, um, I thinking another time I want to wash my hair, whatever, and pin it while I sleep. See what happens when it's wet. But I like this pin thing because it can be kind of messy. When I wake up in the morning, it looks so funny and I flip my hair and I shake, shake, shake. And it's like, I'm done. Hair's done. See, this is still super curly back here. I think from what I can tell. <laughs> Today it was super hot, so um, my hair spent, the back of my hair spent a lot of time in the clip. And, um, which is fine. It can do that, but 
It just looked so beautiful the other day, all curly. So I think this one, like, I feel like I was rolling it almost like um, I had a sponge roller. I think I like the scrunch it up flat type instead because I don't, want it, I don't want it to curl under. I want it to have its natural curl. So I almost feel like this was like when you put the a plop. This is almost like a plop method, but the plop method does not work for me. I would wash and condition my hair and then I would just put it in the t-shirt to and plop it and then it was all flat on my head and my goal is to have volume. Um, I have a very volume personality, but my hair does not. Anyway, okay, so this is what I've got. I'm shaking. See, nothing is loose. I kind of feel like this right here maybe, but I think I'm okay. I'm just going to leave it like that. And in the morning, we will shake, 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 and we'll see what happens. Good morning. So here I am. I'm going to unpin my curls. So I had some fall throughout the night. So I should probably uh, put some stuff on this to activate it. This one, on the other hand, stays super curly. And it's a little bit more frizzy, um, but I'm okay with that. So I'm going to pull out from the bottom up. Um, I'm not going to put anything on this right now because I'm going to see what else I need to, you know, do that too, right? So there's one. Yeah, I just kind of am feeling. But yeah, you can see how funny this looks. It looks really funny right now, right? Let's see if it does the miracle it's done for me every other morning I've done this. It's fascinating that it just falls right back into place, but with more volume for me. I think I have them all out. So look at me. I, I look really funny. This just looks really funny. All right, so we're going to give it a big flip. Shake, shake, shake. I'm going to take my glasses off because they're about to fall. Shake, 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 shake. So I'm not touching it at all, just shaking it, flipping it over, and voila. I've got very fluffy curls. Uh, it, it, it needs to be styled up, and like I have this one underneath here. See, I probably could have just put some stuff on it because very few straight pieces. So now I can go style it any way I want and play with it. But yeah, just pin it in some other little cute little ways. But look, my curls still look very nice and intact. I think they do. I can't see the back, so if the back isn't, no one's telling me. It was a good shake. So, there you go. Have a great day. Thanks so much for watching till the end. I hope you guys enjoyed that. In a little while, I'll have one more video for you from Victoria, at least where she's going to show us her full wash day routine. So you'll get to see her applying products on fully wet hair, shampooing, going through the conditioner, the styler, how she diffuses, um, you know, any techniques that she uses and her results with it um, after it's fully dry and scrunched out and all of that. So that'll be really fun to look forward to. And I have actually five or six more videos in addition to that that I'm working on, that I'm editing. So in the next few weeks, I should start being able to release, you know, one or two of those at a time. So hang tight. There's more to come. See you guys later.